Sometimes analyzing data from a spreadsheet or a cross tab format can be difficult in Tableau. Tableau prefers data to be a tall instead of wide, which means that you often have to pivot your data from columns to row so that Tableau can evaluate it properly. Data pivoting is easy with Tableau prep. A column to row pivot changes the structure of your data from wide to tall by turning columns into rows. This is an easy example. Here you can see that region 2017, 18 and 19 which are the attributes of the table and in region we have two records that is north and south. Instead of visualizing like this, if this table structure has been pivoted like this, we will have a better understanding. Like North region in the year 2017, we had like 250 sales. And in North 2018, what is the sales? And North in 2019, how much sales it is? You can find some more clarity in this table instead of this. So that is why we need the pivot. So this is the wider table where if this is converted into a taller table using a pivot, it will be easy for understanding. This is another example that is we have employee and the date wise parking fee. Here we can see some blank spaces, which is very odd to analyze the data. If the same data is converted into a another type of table which is a taller table using pivot it is very easy to understand this is an another example this you can see this is what the feedback this is the feedback data so the same data is converted into a pivoted data then it is easy to understand so why we need pivot for that i have showed nearly two use cases for you to understand so this is how we can do pivot in tableau prep there is a step called pivot in tableau it is not mandatory that you have to do a cleaning or any other step before pivoting you can directly go ahead with tableau pivot step and then generate it as an output let us see this with an example I'll show you practically like how you can use pivot in Tableau prep. Let us see how to pivot your data. So here I have the data where I have the fields like year, Lumina, Samton, Trirasta and Pedicare. I've performed a cleaning step here. If you want, you can also do that or else you can directly go to the pivot option. So here you can see what changes I have made. I have converted the year into the type. Okay, so there's some different data type, year data type. So now let us see how to add the pivot step. Click on this plus that is to add your step and you have an option called pivot. Click on pivot. You can see that the pivot settings appear. So whatever the fields which you wish to convert that into a row, you can select and drop it. Either you can drop it one by one like this or you can select one and press control and select multiple entries here and click and drag it on the pivot values. Let's see how the data appears before and after pivot. If you go and click on the clean step and click on this data view icon, you can see that year, Lomina, Samton, Tridesta and Vedicare are the individual attributes. Where else, once if you click the pivot and if you see the data grid, you can find here that this is the pivot one name. That is, these are all the names of the pivoted values and name, names of the pivoted column and these are all the names of the pivoted values and this is the year so if you want you can change the name here 
names and also you can change here the value because this is always open in tableau prep you can change the name any in any steps i'm changing here the values and it's then year okay and finally even after this if you want to do any other option like aggregate or um, join or union or any other thing you can definitely do it or if you want to insert a different flow you can also do it or else you can directly go ahead with the output step so for example if you want to aggregate based on because since it's already aggregated like on lumina what is the value and in which year so in 2012 the lumina has this value 2012 sampton has this value like that it is already aggregated so you can directly go ahead with the output step so click here output and select whether you have to publish the data source or the data table or you want to stay save it as a file then you can select where you have to store it okay so i am selecting here that this is the pivot output and if you want to save this as an excel file you can save it as an excel file you have to create a worksheet okay so i am saving this as an excel file and you have to give the worksheet name and you can also create a table and click run flow where your flow will be executed and the output will be generated so this is how you can create the you can pivot your values in tableau prep it's a very easy step so you can try this and let me know how you understand the concept and how did you try this and whether did you got the expected output thank you for watching keep sharing the video and if you have any doubts you can post it in the comment section as well so i'll be there and i'll be very happy to explain and solve your doubts thank you bye bye